Alright, so what is good YouTube? It's your boy Legendary EA back here for another video and today we will be rebuilding the Phoenix Suns around Josh Jackson. Now first off, shout out to Six Rings of Steel. I did get this idea from him. He actually did the Philadelphia 76ers with Lonzo Ball. So if you guys want to see something like that, make sure you go ahead and check out his channel. And if you guys missed my video from yesterday, Markel Folks versus Lonzo Ball, who is worthy of the number one overall pick? Make sure you go ahead and check that out. I did break down some pros and cons between both of those guys. And I think that... Yeah, both of them are worthy of the number one overall pick, but some people would like me to throw Josh Jackson in that discussion. Personally, I don't think it, but I still think that he does have a chance to be a great player. But let's get straight into this video. If you guys want to see more stuff like this, make sure you go ahead and slap that like button for, for more of these videos, you guys. I really do enjoy it. And let's aim for 350 likes for another one, y'all. And please make sure to go ahead and share the video, and please subscribe if you guys are new. But other than that, y'all, let's get it. So Russell Westbrook is the MVP, averaging a triple-double, Joel Embiid Rookie of the year Tyler Johnson wins six man of the year and all this stuff that nobody really cares about because we are here for the offseason I'm pretty sure no Phoenix Suns made any of these teams well there goes Marquise Chris so obviously this team is not in the playoffs yet, but I just want to see what this team can do can I can I turn this team around I mean we have Eric Bledsoe we had Devin Booker and at first I was actually thinking about doing doing something where I just moved on past Eric Bledsoe but, the, but, but then I was like if the Suns are there Bledsoe was balling out, so why would they trade him? But anyways, Golden State wins the championship versus Toronto as they beat Cleveland in seven in the Eastern Conference Finals. But that's what's up. That's what's up. But let's get straight into this offseason, and let's see if we can come away with the top three pick and pick up Josh Jackson. So heading into the draft lottery, where are we? We are projected to have the ninth pick. Dang. And we, yeah, we, we, we have the ninth pick, but let's see what we can do. And then the Kings come away with the fourth and the fifth pick. Yo, if they, if they take, if, if the Pelicans take those kind of L's, then that's going to be sad, y'all. But hopefully I can just do something to just to go ahead and slide in that top three. All right. So we pick up the third pick with that. But let's hop into the NBA draft and let's see who we can possibly pick up. And we are looking at Josh Jackson at all costs. So let's hope he's there at number three. So with the first pick in the draft, let's see. I have a feeling that they take Josh Jackson, but but I, I just hope that they take somebody else, anybody else. And the Magic take Markel Folks. All right. Next up, we got Boston. Who 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 y'all about to say? Who y'all are y'all about? Y'all take Dennis Smith. So right here. All right. Let's look at the trade offers. Obviously, I'm not gonna trade it away. I do want to pick up Josh Jackson, but let's see which type of trade offers 2K is offering me. Kemba Walker, Markel, CJ McCollum, they are always doing that, but with this pick, I already told you guys who I'm going to be taking, and I'm and I'm taking Josh Jackson, I think that this is a great stepping stone, and while I'm here, we, we might as well trade away a few pieces that we really don't need, I'm going to keep, actually, the only one I'm trading away now is, J is Jared Dudley, a everybody else, I'm going to hold off, just to see what I could possibly get for them, but right now, Jared Dudley, First round picks looks look nice. Uh, yeah, let's take this pick from Chicago. You got you guys kind of you guys kind of just played yourself. So looking at the draft, yo, Lonzo Ball won 11th, 11th. Nah, fam. But anyways, we are gonna be picking up Josh Jackson. Obviously, we drafted him with the third overall pick, and Devin Booker, T.J. Warren, and let's let's we we might as well bring back Leonardo Barbosa. Those guys were we are we are obviously gonna be, be bringing them back now. This isn't meant to be one of my more realistic my GMs, uh, my leagues, as to none of them really are. But let's see who we can pull in in free agency if, if anybody wants to come here, if we even have the money, which we don't. Two from the Wizards. That's a bet. I don't know why they would give me that, but I really do appreciate it. Like, that's that's a steal. That's a steal. But, yo, we're going to go out here and try to sign Durant. If we do, if we do pick him up, which we are not. I'm trading him away, but we aren't getting him anyway, so it really doesn't matter. Steph Curry, you want to come here? Nope. Does anybody want to come here? So in the middle of free agency, we will be trading away Brandon Knight into second-round picks just because I feel like he's making a lot of money. The production really is not there. Uh, I mean, if, if I'm doing that, I might as well get Austin Rivers, and he's a little bit better. But let's see if there's anybody else. 
It's really whatever. So Brandon Knight, two two seconds for Jordan Clarkson and Zubiak. That's what's up with me. But anyways, let's see if we can bring in Paul Millsap and immediately flip this man. All right, I'm going to offer him a, a smaller contract because obviously he, he ain't with the shits. But he healed? They, they really want to do this trade? I mean, Buddy's ass, but... Buddy's really ass, but eh, I'm gonna I'm I'm gonna do it though. Y'all y'all wanna slot me a first? Not for Zach Randolph, man. For Derek Jones, yeah. I don't know. Uh, in reality, it really don't matter. So I guess we'll be trading away Dragon Bender, Tyson Chandler, Derek Jones Jr., who kind of who kind of blew the dunk contest, David West and Zaza, in return for Buddy Hill, the first, who they call his son, and Giorgio's Papa Giannis. It really don't matter, y'all. Buddy Hill, I mean, that's a nice backup. To, like, I'm being honest, that's a really good backup. So, I'm I'm cool with that. Especially since she plays better in 2K anyways. But, let's go ahead and offer this man Paul Millsap again. Alex Lenz, about to... Alex, bro. I forgot all, all about that, man, to be honest. But, yo, let's just bring in Paul Millsap. And immediately, let's flip this man. And let's see what we can get for him in two first-round picks. But how about this? All right, it's a bet. We picked up an extra first-round pick with that trade. But we got Rudy Gobert. We got Rudy Gobert, Bledsoe, Booker. This seems not that bad. I think we might actually be able to actually do something in the Western Conference. But other than that, y'all, let's get straight into next season. And let's see what we can possibly do with this team. For the lineup for season number one is Eric Bledsoe, Devin Booker, Josh Jackson, Rudy, Zach Randolph, and Rudy Gobert. Now, Bl Booker didn't develop like I wanted him to, but I am going to test the, the market for Eric Bledsoe just to see what I could possibly get for this man. He's a great point guard, but I just want to see what's out there for him. And, yeah, these offers are pretty ass. So, and you know what, guys? Let's just see what this team can do in season number one with no other trades let, let's see what this team is all about and let's see if they actually even make the playoffs because i do kind of question that but let's just see and at the end of season number one russell westford goes back to back as the mvp markel folks wins rookie of the year in orlando gordon six man in the year and coach he goes coach the goes to tyron Lou. so did any sons make it i still highly doubt it but still josh jackson all rookie first team doing whatever he did we finished as a fourth seed which is a drastic improvement but definitely not where i wanted to be and as far as the standings go all right eight games beyond the golden state warriors so maybe we actually have a shot at this maybe we, maybe we have a shot but as far as the stats booker legends in scoring with 20 points a game josh jackson put up nine points a game six rebounds two steals one and a half blocks and, yo, TJ Warren coming up the bench, putting up 12. But that's what's up, y'all. But let's just see if we can go ahead and win this NBA championship in season number one. I highly doubt it, but, yo, who knows? Brian won versus the Denver Nuggets. They shouldn't really be a problem for us. And we win in six. Up against Golden State, though. They take game one. They take game two. We take game three. They take game four. And, yeah. Yeah, we... We lost. But anyways, Minnesota makes it to the NBA Finals and they lose in six to the Raptors. For some reason, LeBron just he 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 just can't get back. But let's see what we can do this offseason. And we need to make some moves. Some just some crazy ass moves to be honest. So we walked away with the fourth overall pick in this draft. Now, as far as what I want to do with it, I don't know. Let's hop into the NBA draft and let's find out. Alright, the prospects in this draft. Where that? Where that though? Okay. Michael. Po oh, he's a 74 Verado. Yeah. Let's let's trade this away. They, they got Jello. Yeah. I, I'm gonna go ahead and trade away th this pick. Like it, it's not gonna bring any value to me at all. So let's see what we can get with the fourth pick. Otto Porter, Jason Tatum. Yeah. These offers are pretty bad, but <laughs> I think somebody. Offered us Paul Millsap too. Nah, fam. We're, we're, we are definitely good on that one. But. Damn. Really? There's really nothing. All right. Let's 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 pair up the fourth pick. Egg Bloods was 86. I might keep him. But let's trade away with Jordan Clarkson. Ooh. Kemba Walker. That Kemba trade is the best one. How about with, with Eric Bledsoe, though? We can get Kevin Love. Kevin Love and Tristan Thompson. 
and a Dame Dalla? I'm taking that trade. Oh my Damian Lillard. I'm I'm sorry if you guys are a fan. I'm sorry if you guys are a fan of him, but yo, that's a that's something I can't pass on. Alright. The picks really don't matter to me, so let's do it. Two first round picks, Eric Bledsoe and Alex Lynn, in return for Dame Dalla, Afrika Aminu, Yusuf Nurtic, and a first round pick. We and we finesse them. And that's what I like to see, y'all. I I I love that trade. I love it a lot. And we're gonna flip this guy right here uh, for a first round pick. Afaruk, love you. But we just finessed. So we're adding interesting player options. Of course, I'm planning on bringing all these guys back. We, we got Buddy Hield on the team. Paul George. Now that now that's interesting. Alright, so we're gonna do this trade right here. Clarkson, Nurtic, two first rounders for a first rounder, Collison, Ivan Rab. I really just did that trade for Ivan Rab, to be honest. Because Collison, he's not he's not really gonna last here. So let's trade him away with Costa Kufos, because both of them guys are getting hella overpaid. Nah. Alright, let's do the original trade. Dare Collison, Costa Kufos for these guys, and I have to flip away John Henson. Oh my god. So much, so much flipping going on. Just give me a pick. Anybody? All right. How about a first rounder now? Grizzlies, appreciate you. Now let's hop back in free agency. We're still 15 million. We we are still broke. We are still broke. All right. And next up, we will be sending Marquise Chris, Willie Collins, and a first round pick to the Spurs for two of their picks. How much? We still we still broke though. We got 18 million in cap room. Damn. I, I want to keep Buddy Healed for sure. San Antonio is picking up all of our bigs at this point. Every single one of them. All right. I still think that we still don't have enough money. But I'm close. I I I could get Isaiah Thomas. I don't really need him right now. Melo still wants that. He wants that crazy money that he's not going to get. But I would like to get Paul George or actually DeMarcus Cousins and play him at Power Forward. So we're we're 2 million off. But this defeats the entire trade. But at least now we have a backup. Actually, nah. But yeah, I, I don't I don't want I, I don't even want that guy. All right. We should still be like a million off, but So we're going to take that trade. Like uh, all I want is a pick. I don't, I don't even want these players. Just give me like a second round pick or anything. Dang. Thank you, Houston. That, that's all that I asked for. Now, with that said, we can pick up Boogie, hopefully. I mean, we, we, we did just send all of our players there. So, Boogie is definitely a possibility of playing my power forward. And where's number one squad? All right. And PG, just in case, as a backup plan, pick him up. Now, I would like to trade these players if I can, but, yo, I, I would like to keep them as well. We're not going to get half of them, though, but still. And on day two, we pull in DeMarcus Cousins. We, we missed on Paul George, but we get Boogie. And that's something to, to take note of. Uh, yeah, let's bring in all these guys. Jalen Hands, LiAngelo Ball. Damn, Dirk, you really kind of hold us. But Melo still ain't got no offers, and he still don't want to come here. So that, that's on him. So I do want to field offers for DeMarcus. He's probably not going to get moved because I plan on playing my power forward. But is there anything? Th th there's nothing crazy out here. Ooh. This is crazy, though. That one's crazy. I mean, Boogie's nice. They offer him Paul George and Miles Turner. Yeah. Ah, I'm going to take it. I'm, I'm going to take that trade. And the reason why, because Miles Turner takes Boogie's role at power forward. Oh, whoa. All right. There we go. Yeah. And we got PG. This team, we have a point guard. We have a shooting. We have a small forward, power forward, and center. Our starting lineup is nasty. Off bench, we got Josh Jackson. Now, this, the whole goal of this video was to build around him. Unfortunately, that couldn't really work out. But we still have him on, on the roster. And we're still going to win a championship probably. This team is nasty. I'm not gonna flex. This team is this, this team is nasty. And for season number three lineup is Damian Lillard, Devin Booker, Paul George, Miles Turner, and Rudy Gobert. And the bench is still nice. We got Josh Jackson, Derek Favors, TJ Warren, Ivan Rabin, Buddy Hield. Now we need a backup point guard. And we got Willie Hernan Gomez. So 
TJ Warren, let's see what we can get for you. We have abundance of picks. That I might even try to test out the value for PG, Turner, Gobert, and all those players. Just see if we can upgrade anywhere. And with this next trade, we will be trading away TJ Warren, a first round pick, and Jalen Hands over to the Cleveland Cavaliers for Tristan Thompson and Patty Mills. Yo, LeBron, you out here, you just keep showing love, homie. Thank you. But, yo, like I said, I, I want to trade. I want to test out this value on all of our starters just to see what's out there. For Dame Dalla, nothing crazy. Yeah, nothing crazy at all. So, he's obviously off the block. PG, let's see what I can get for him. We can get Kevin Love and T. Nah, B. <laughs> nah, that's pretty trash. Uh, Gordon Hayward, they're about the same. Nah. Yeah, none of these, none of these, ooh, Draymond, nah, none of these trades are, like, really c convincing at all, uh, let, let's look at Rudy Gobert, I can get Kevin Love for Rudy Gobert, nah, just, even, nah, nah, uh, how about Miles Turner, Miles, now, Yeah, nothing here is like really that crazy, but I think we're good. I honestly do, but hold on. Tristan Thompson, I, I don't even want him on the squad. So if something like Kevin Love pops up, I will gladly just take the trade. Harry Giles and hell and all. So next up, I do want to see if this trade is going to work. All these guys for Kemba Walker. All right, yeah. I told you, he, he's so easy to get. And I was like, why not? Why not add the GOAT to my super team? So our super team consists of Damian Lillard, Devin Booker, Paul George, Miles Turner, Rudy Gobert, and off the bench we got Kemba Walker, Josh Jackson, Tristan Thompson, Ivan Rabb, Buddy Heald, Willie Hernan Gomez, Patty Mills, and Amir Johnson, and Leangelo Ball. Now, before I do that, you know, you know, I I I, I always got to test this out, see what we can get. And nothing interesting. But, yo, this team is definitely stacked. And I think that we can definitely win a championship. And let's see what we can do at the end of season number three. And I'm expecting an NBA championship. And at the end of season number three, Westbrook three-piece as the MVP. Averaging a triple-double for the third time in a row. Yo, this shit's getting out of hand, man. Three triple-doubles. Michael Porter's rookie of the year. Kemba Walker's sixth man of the year for our squad. He puts up 16 points. Three re Three rebounds, six assists, and he's doing his thing off the bench for us. And Jordan Clarkson's most improved. And Coach is Mike D'Antoni back in Phoenix, yo. Back in Phoenix with us. 63-19 record. This team was nasty, bro. This team was gross. And we had the best super team ever. D'Angelo Russell's All-NBA 13 now. I would hope that would happen in real life since I was betting everything on him. But probably won't. But anyways, as far as the standings go, obviously, we, we were first. in the second seed was Houston, nine games behind us. We beat everybody in the Eastern Conference. Cleveland is not even number one anymore. As far as our stats go, Devin Booker led, led us in scoring 18 points a game. Dame Dollar with 17 and 8. PG with 17. Kemba off the bench. Miles Turner doing his thing. Josh Jackson was 7. Okay. Okay, uh, let's see if we can go ahead and win a championship with this squad, bro. I mean, best record in the NBA. Go, Golden State should not be a problem, hopefully. All right, we beat them in five. Is Kevin Durant even still on their team? I don't even know. Yeah. Curry, KD, Clay, Draymond? It's, damn, y'all really ain't. Y'all really, y'all really nothing now. Uh, up against San Antonio, they take game one. They take game two, we take game three, they take game four. Bro, oh my freaking, how does 2K come up with this stuff? And Bledsoe's finals MVP, and I'm, what? Did they win a championship with CJ, Bledsoe, JaVel McGee, Harry? I'm, this game is broke. I would do it in the season, but no, I, I, after that BS, I can't do it. I can't do another season, but this was our final roster, y'all. Dame Dollar, PG, Kemba Walker, Miles Turner, Rudy Gobert, Devin Booker, Tristan Thompson, Josh Jackson, Ivan Rabb, Willie Hernan Gomez, Buddy Heald, Patty, Patty Mills, Amir Johnson, and Leangela Ball. And y'all and y'all tell me how that team gets bounced by this team. Well, granted, it, it is Isaiah Thomas and Kawhi Leonard, but yo, bruh, are y'all serious though? Our team was way better. But you know what? 
Let me know what you guys think about that. Which team was better, us or San Antonio? And hope you guys enjoyed this video. And like I said, make sure you go ahead and get 350 likes to show that love and the support. Y'all really do appreciate it, y'all. And please make sure you go ahead and leave a like on this video. And please subscribe if you guys are brand new to the channel. Join Team EA. Join the Army. It's lit over here, y'all. We're back on that grind. My second upload of the day. Please follow me on Twitch. My Twitch link is in the description below. And I might, honestly... I am live streaming later on today, and, and if I have enough followers, I, I'm going to be doing it on Twitch. So make sure you go ahead and follow, 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 show that love, and, I, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace, y'all.